Welcome to Daily Green Channel. We made a series of videos to help you understand the BMS better. Here's an example of 7S 24V BMS wiring instruction. Before wiring, we need to prepare the tools such as solder device, multimeter solder wire, BMS wires, and battery pack. Before wiring, we should know how many series of the pack. This pack is 7S7P pack. Why is it 7P? You can see there are 7 cells in parallel. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Totally 49 cells. Step 1. We must find where the total negative pole and the total positive pole of the pack are located. Many people don't know. We can use the multimeter to measure it. First, turn the meter to DC. Use the black probe measure this side and the red probe measure the other side. We can see a data 25 volts. If we do it oppositely, now the voltage becomes minus 25 volts. So this side is the total negative pole. From the appearance of the battery cell, the negative pole is flat. Step 2. For beginner, suggest you set the solder temperature as 350 degrees. Start from the black wire to total negative pole. We connect the black wire to the total negative pole. Please don't plug the wires to the BMS, which may be cause short circuit. Keep the other wires always from batteries, which may cause short circuit too. Then connect the first battery. If you are not sure it is the first series of battery or not, you can use the meter to measure it. Measure between total negative power and positive power of first battery. You can see the volt is 3.59, so it proves this is the positive pole of the first cell and the negative pole of the second cell. We connect the first red wire here. Now connect the second red wire to the positive pole of the second cell. Use the same way to check whether it is the second serial of battery. Then connect the third wire. Please connect them in turn and can be mixed the sequence. How to make sure everything is right? Use multimeter black probe touch the total negative pole. The red probe touch the first red wire. Now we see the volt is 3.595. You can't touch the two probes together, which may cause smoke or short circuit. Step 3. Connect the total negative pole of the wire of the pack. Now you can plug the wires to the BMS. How to test if the wiring is correct? Black probe touch P minus, red probe touch total positive pole of the pack. The volt is 25.18. It means the BMS has working. Measure the total volts of the pack, 25.19, only 0.01 volt difference, which is normal. Okay, the wiring is finished. Welcome to Daily Green Channel. How does BMS overcharge protection work? Three minutes will help you totally understand it.